Hi guys, it's B. Welcome to another episode of Tuesday Play-Doh. Today I'll be reviewing this Play-Doh picnic bucket. And there's lots of things you can make with this Play-Doh, so let's get started. We have lots of molds in here. Some tools. We got four cans of Play-Doh and some more molds. Put our lid back. Put that here. So I'm going to start by taking out my Play-Doh. We have white, brown. We have like a red. So I'm going to get it out. So that is red. And like a light brown. Like a peanut color. So we have a few molds. We have a bread mold to make a sandwich. Um, like a, a meat mold and some cheese. Here we have like an apple. Cookie, yum yum. Some bananas and strawberries. We have a pretzel and a pear. So I'm gonna start by making a sandwich. I'm gonna start with two breads. I'm gonna use my light brown. I'm actually going to make it white, so let's make it white. Kind of squeeze it to the edges so the plate will get there. And press. And take it out. So we got it out. Let's remove the excess. And it looks just like a white bread. Let's make another one. And we're gonna press. Right, get it out. And remove the excess. And voila. Now we're going to make our, where is it? Our meat using brown potato. And press. Get it out. And remove the excess. So we're going to grab the bottom of our little sandwich and we're going to place it there. Put that off to the side. This Play-Doh didn't come with it, but I'm gonna use it for the cheese. It's yellow because I want my my cheese to be yellow. I'm gonna kind of spread it around. Then press. I'm going to get it out. And we're going to remove the axis. And here's my cheese. And it, it looks like real cheese because of the holes. Look at those holes. And we're going to place it there. And I'm going to add something extra that didn't came with like a mold. I'm going to make some circles so it can look like red tomato. So I'm just gonna kinda make it into a circle shape. So you can see. So then we're going to place it right there. Like that. And we're going to grab our bread, our top part, and just place it on the top, and voila, there's our sandwich. It looks really yummy, I wanna eat it. So yum. I'm just gonna place it there. And now to go with it, I'm going to make I'm going to make some brown pretzels. I'm going to use both brown both colors. I'm going to start with my light one. And 
and press. There's our pretzel. Now we're going to remove the excess. And there we go. So I'm going to put some little white spots with my white Play-Doh so it can look like a little sea salt. Okay. So here's my pretzel with sea salt. That looks so real. Yum yum. There. And we're going to make one with the dark brown. Now we're going to press. We're going to get it out and remove the excess. And there we go. It looks so yummy and so real. Let me make two pretzels. There we go. Okay, so now I'm going to make all the fruit. For my pan, I'm going to use this blue turquoise color. Put it in there. And press. Get it out. Here's my pear. Yum yum. Okay, so now I'm going to use my red for my strawberry. And for the top part of the green little stem, I'm going to use my green. First, the red. And then my green. And press. I'm going to get it out if I can. So here's my strawberry. It looks really good. Okay, so now I'm going to make some bananas with yellow. Here are my three bananas. It looks so real. Mini bananas. Maybe we should feed the minions. Okay, so now I'm going to set it to the side. And for my last fruit, I'm going to be doing my apple. Also red. A little stem. Going to be green. And you can also make the apple green, because some people eat green um green apples like I do sometimes and they're my favorite but I'm making this one red and we are going to press really good and we're going to remove the excess it actually looks like a tomato, but it's actually an apple. Yum, yum. And for my last thing, the cookie. My chocolate chip cookie. So for my little chocolate chips, I'm going to be using my brown. For the cookie, I'm going to be using the light brown. So I'm going to press. This is going to be a delicious cookie. So let's get it out. Here's my cookie. Now let's do our chocolate chips. So now let's press so we can make the little shape of the chocolate chips. And ta-da! That looks so yummy. Well guys, here are all the creations I made. My favorite was the sandwich and the cookies. Yum yum. And I made an extra one. Well guys, that's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, and I'll see you in my next video guys. Bye!